So hello students and welcome back to my new topic and I am back with my new topic I am Sarim Khan studying in 5th standard So today I have brought for you the class 11th NCRT Mathematics chapter number 1st sets exercise 1.1 question number 2nd solved So today I am going to solve the question number 2nd As in my previous video I had solved the question number 4 or stop this exercise 1.1 from sets and today I am going to solve the question number 2nd so the question number second from this chapter is from this uh exercise is let a equals to 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay insert the appropriate symbol epsilon or epsilon not in the blank spaces okay so this greek symbol is called epsilon okay and this epsilon belong stands for belongs to okay but if there is a crossover epsilon means does not belongs to Okay, so here we have to, here are some, um, here some options have been given to us. Okay, we have to fill, okay, some blank spaces are also given to us. We have to fill the appropriate symbol, means the correct symbol. So here, the first is 5 dash A. Okay, five, it means we have to tell that whether 5 is belongs to A or not. This A, what is our A? This whole set, this whole our set of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 is called A here. Okay, in this question. So here it is asking whether 5 belongs to A or 5 does not belongs to A. So here we can check in this set that here we get 5 here. Okay, in the set 5 is present. And if 5 is present in the set, means 5 belongs to the to this set. Means 5 is an element of the set, okay, that is A. So, we'll put this, uh, this, okay, symbol of epsilon, okay, that means belongs to. Now, here it is, A dash A. Now, here, here we can notice one thing that A, whether it belongs to A or it does not belongs to A. So, here we have only 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay, after that 7, 8, it haven't gone any more forward. And this is why, that is the main reason. Here we'll put the symbol of epsilon naught. Okay, why epsilon naught? Here we'll put epsilon letter cross it like this. Because here we can notice one thing that it does not belongs to A. Okay, to the set A. The next is 0 dash A. Here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 where 0 there, okay, where there is no spot of 0 means 0 does not belong. So we'll put epsilon single. Sorry, epsilon not symbol. Next is 4 dash A. So here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 where we, where we can see here 4. And if 4 is present in the set, it means that 4, 4 is such a number that belongs to that set. And if 4 is belonging to the set, so we'll put the symbol of belongs to, belongs to by the Greeks, which is denoted by Greek symbol, that is epsilon. Okay, so so much done, 4 are done, there are total 6. And the next is 2 dash a okay so here we have in this also 2 also we have and if 2 we have means 2 also belongs to a so we'll put epsilon symbol here and the next is 10 10 dash a but here we have only 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 okay where there is no spot of 10 this is why that is the main reason we'll put here okay epsilon letter cross it that is epsilon naught why we have done so because actually 10 does not belongs to a and if 10 does not belongs to any set so between the um, the symbol will be this so if you find my, this video helpful so please like this video and subscribe my channel thank you